this video, we're going over the hypothetical results for the V-reversal trading system between NinjaTrader 8 and TradeStation. You can see the most recent trade today before Labor Day 2024, August 30th. This is the trading system signal, and it took a short trade, and now it is flat. And we're going to compare the results of both of these platforms. There is no slippage in commission. The reason there is no slippage in commission is because the platforms can calculate slippage differently and TradeStation uses a straight dollar amount and NinjaTrader it's a point value and sometimes I believe um, based on what I'm seeing is that um, if if you're stopped out the lows it doesn't include that slippage while at TradeStation has a straight line average in NinjaTrader it does discern times where there may not be slippage uh, for example being stopped out on the low there is no additional slippage on that trade and so um, for the purpose of this video, we're not using slippage, so we can see the comparison. Oftentimes, when you do cross-platform comparisons, there's always going to be slight differences between the platforms, and removing any factors such as slippage and commission calculations can help you reconcile any of those differences. And so in this setup, you see there is a slight difference without any sort of slippage and commission calculations. In TradeStation, there's $230,600 total net profit. 27 4, 430 close trade drawdown and this is the number that matters the most on day trade strategies and on swing trade strategies this is the number that matters the most um, and so in ninja trader 227,000 total net profit about three thousand six hundred dollars difference and the drawdown is 24 155 also about thirty three hundred dollars difference there as well uh, 1,455 trades versus uh, 1,402 trades. We'd have to go uh, go in and trade by trade basis or look at the periodic returns to see where those trade differences were. The average trade profit, you see no slippage in commission, but the average trade profit is 164 in TradeStation, is 156 in NinjaTrader. And so let's look at the equity curve though because we want to see where the relevance uh, is in this strategy when it performed and if you look back to March of 2020 the beginning of pandemic it's kind of a new pattern since the beginning of pandemic and you see the worst case drawdown is right here and so since about this time frame since about April of 2021 this strategy um, has had a lower drawdown than it had prior to April of 2021 this is where the largest drawdown is and the average trade profit would also be higher from April 2021 forward. And so you can see that in the NinjaTrader equity curve. When I click on TradeStation, this will disappear. So I'm going to click on this performance summary. And then I'll have to pull that back up. So there it is. Um, you can see the um, TradeStation equity curve. This is back to 2018. And it's, sli it's slightly different in that time period than the NinjaTrader equity curve. And so you still see the worst case drawdown occurring right here. And the average trade profit is best since about April of 2021. So let's look. I'm going to change. pause the video. I'm going to change the date. And to April 2021, what is the average trade profit since that time? What is the worst case drawdown since that time? So one of the benefits of looking at this in a uh, shorter time period is because oftentimes the uh, potentially data differences could increase on historical data. And so just going back to April of 2021, we see that results are much closer. You see in TradeStation 196, 680, uh, 964 trades versus 195, 260. And there are 966 trades. I actually... Um, overwrote that. So let me delete this and start over. But you can see um, the differences here. 196, 680, 964 trades, 195, 260, so uh, $1,400 difference, and 966 trades. 202 average trade profit versus 204 average trade profit. The um, max drawdown is 17,195 versus 15,950, about $1,200 difference there. 
and you can see um, let's take a look here um, again this is no slippage in commission so you get two hundred two dollars before slippage in commission which is a, a pretty big margin to work with and then you get um, let's look at the equity curves let's look at the analysis here is the equity curve in NinjaTrader 8 this is the equity curve in TradeStation and so very uh, similar twists and turns it just looks a little different it's expressed differently a little bit and so um, visually but it is the same chart same uh, basically the same type of trades making equity peaks again the main point of this video is to look at the uh, differences between two platforms it's the same trading system on two different platforms using the same market what does this look like we will look at the last few trades in TradeStation as well as NinjaTrader. So I'm going to close these down. You can see short trade winner, short trade winner, long trade winner, long trade loser, long winner, long winner. And so this has a mix of winners and losers. And you can see what those look like. There's some short losses there, a short loss there. Um, if you scroll back, there's some more. Um, there is a long loss right there getting stopped out at that low. Track the daily PLs. Yellow means a losing trade, two losing trades there, one winning trade here, one loser, one winner, one loser. These are hypotheticals. And let's look at Ninja Trader. You can see the trades here a short trade, short trade, um, a long loser, a long win winner there. Um, same trades based off the top of my head, about the same as the trade station. As we've seen the statistics, similar. Um, you have a short loss there. Where is that day where there was two short losers? There was a day, see there's a losing trade here on the short side and then another losing trade there. So sometimes you have um, losing trade, two losing trades in a row on the same day and you can take up to two trades per day on this strategy. And that is the analysis between TradeStation and NinjaTrader on our V-Reversal uh, 24 strategy. Hey, David Bean here. Welcome to Capstone Trading Systems YouTube page. Be sure to subscribe to join our community of algorithmic traders. We are real money traders. We share our winning streaks, we share our losing streaks, as well as market updates, strategies, and coding tips.